I think the thing is, is a lot of people don't realise what sort of power some of these dogs have got. And I think if you do own a big dog, then you should be responsible. You should clear up after it, have ID on it, take it to dog training. Um, it affects everywhere at the moment, um, but especially in Luton, obviously, as a dog warden service, we get involved of any problems with large dogs. Um, again, it's the, it's the threatening aspect. Um, I'm not sure about Luton, but I know that sometimes they're used to threaten people, so they hand over cash or mobile phones. Um, and also, obviously, drugs, things like that. Some of the drug dealers have them for protection. And I think sometimes people might want a dog for protection, but they don't know what they're going, not their, you know, what they're going to handle and what they end up with. So if you imagine that, that I'm, I'm after a dog, and the dog comes at me, and I've got that to block it. All dogs should be microchipped. In an ideal world, I think all dogs, whether it be status or a little chihuahua or whatever, all dogs should be taken to dog training. I think a lot of it is people, if they're going to get a dog, they need to know their responsibilities, they know what they're taking on. Um, there is this problem where everybody thinks they're cool because they've got a big dog. That's fine until the dog maybe gets to 18, 20 months when it becomes a teenager, if you like, um, and then becomes aggressive.